Hello everybody, Kenny with Fort Wayne Helicopters and I wanted to do some of my helicopter threes that I like so much. The number three is such a great number and there's so many things in the helicopter training that come around that come in threes and it's when you get really thinking about it, it's pretty incredible. So the one I wanted to hit real quick is the three forms of stored energy. If the examiner says what are the three types of stored energy we, energy we have when we're flying or in the helicopter, it's altitude, airspeed, and RPM. Why do we care? We care because if you have all three of those things together, your airspeed, your altitude, and RPM where it needs to be, you can probably handle about any emergency that's going to come along. The problem is if you're lacking in any, any one of those three and you run into some type of an emergency, it's going to be a lot harder for you to deal with that emergency. So you know, there's a lot of things in the helicopter training we talk about, height velocity, height, velocity diagram, and so on and so forth and take technique in the way we take off and we land. We're always trying to set up our cells up for an engine failure. You're taking off and maybe I'm going to turn left instead of turn right to be over open areas. And if you're always using those good techniques and you have the three forms of stored energy, RPM, altitude, airspeed, if you have all three of those things then you're having a pretty good day. So another check ride tip, one of the helicopter threes, rotor RPM, altitude, airspeed, the three forms of stored energy. As always, thanks for stopping by. If this helps you at all, you, you enjoy it, please click the like button. And don't forget to stop by our blog site at fwhihelicopters.com. All right, thanks everybody. We'll talk to you later.